Okay, so you clicked on this video because you're interested in getting more information about ridge vents. Well, I'm gonna show you what ridge vents are and why I think you actually need them. Okay, before we get started in the video, I want to tell you a little bit about myself just so you're comfortable with who you're getting advice from. So my name is Zach Flingensop. I'm a U.S. military veteran and now I'm a licensed general contractor and roofing contractor in over nine states. So we do projects from Philly up the street all the way through the United States government. So I just want to make you feel comfortable that you're getting good advice about ridge vent from a qualified person. Okay, so I'm about to give you the four different reasons why I think Ridge vents are superior than traditional vents. I'm gonna show you a couple different types of these different box vents. And then at the very end, we're actually gonna go up and see what ridge vent looks like when it's installed. Now I have two of your traditional box vents right here. There's also a big mushroom vent again, but we're just gonna use these for the sake of the video. And these are your traditional box vents. Now these have been used for a very, very long time. And keep in mind guys, there are plenty of three tab asphalt shingle roofs out there with these installed that have lasted over 20 years and no leaks. Now, ridge vent is superior, but these still work. Now, I'm gonna give you the reasons why I think they're not the best option. Uh, option number one really is, these are still prone to leak. And the reason because that is, is anytime that you have a flat surface, which is your roof, and you put a hole there to put one of these on here, when you put this over the top, we have to nail these in, right? And we put caulking over the top and stuff, making sure they don't leak. But these can still leak because there's you're putting this over the top of a hole. So one of the reasons I like ridge vent is it goes on the very top, so you're eliminating those protrusions from the roof. So anytime that you don't want a roof to leak, you, you eliminate the opportunities in the areas for it to leak, well, the odds of it leaking go down substantially. So. That's one reason I think ridge vents better is because it eliminates these protrusions on your roof and you're gonna have to have several of these on your roofing system to have the proper ventilation. Uh, reason number two is these things can rust. Uh, with ridge vent, it's made of plastic, um, so it's not gonna rust over time. Most every single vent that you're gonna see are made, is made out of some type of really light, thin metal. And anytime these things will rust over time, now a lot of roofers will actually reuse a lot of the, the vents if they're still in really good shape. I don't, I don't recommend that because a lot of times once the paint comes off, you're getting just getting metal, straight metal contact with water and you can cause rust either close here to where the, the nails are driven through or anywhere on top of here that can allow water into the home, which obviously is not what you want. So uh, that's another reason is because of the rust. Bridge vents don't rust, these do. Uh, number three is, these can house actually some really crazy critters and insects. So um, over time, I have climbed up on enough roofs to get some surprises from these things, uh, from, from birds to wasp nests to bees to uh, squirrels that have gotten up in here, especially in some of the bigger box vents that's up there. So while I'm all about the critters and you know the animals and stuff, their house probably isn't best to be right on top of your house in one of these. And a lot of times, you know, those critters can also cause some damage or actually get down into your uh, into your attic. So again, by eliminating these altogether, it eliminates those critters from being able to get access into your attic space and then probably into your home. So number three is these eliminate having critters. Uh, and the final thing that I think that Ridge Vent is just superior for is because every type of other ventilation system is gonna go close to the top of your roof. Now, it doesn't take a rocket science to, scientist to understand that if you just put your vent at the highest point of the roof, it's going to be the best place for it to release heat. So, ridge vent actually is gonna go right over the top of your ridge, which is where the two places of your roof are gonna meet, right? It's gonna create a ridge. The ridge vent just goes right over the top of it, just like this. So, if you can see it from this angle, I hope this camera is giving a good uh, example of this, but it's just gonna go right over the top and we're gonna look at it when we get up on the roof. But it's just the natural 
best way for your ventilation to be. So those are my four reasons. Now, before I let you go, we're gonna hop up on the roof and we're gonna take a look at what Ridge Vent looks like when it's actually installed. Okay, so we're up here up on the roof and here is our Ridge Vent system. So we have our Ridge caps right over the top of our Ridge Vent. And as you can see in that previous shot, they're just folded over the two ridges of the roof. And there should be about a three and a half inch gap right here on our decking to allow the ventilation. So like I said, it's a natural ventilation. There's no critters up here, a couple small leaves. Come clean this out about once a year. As you can see behind me, there's no penetration of other vents that can cause leaks in the future. That's the number one reason why I like this system is it doesn't leak. Hey guys, I hope that answered any questions that you have about Ridge Vent and now you know why at least I think that Ridge Vent is far superior than your traditional vents. If you have any additional questions, just leave us a comment here on the YouTube channel. We'll be happy to answer it. And also, if, if you enjoyed the video, guys, please give me a thumbs up. It really helps out the channel a lot. And if you want to see more content, you can always subscribe to us. Or you can go to our website at digitalroofingcompany.com and check out our blog section. Here at Digital Roofing Innovations, we believe in a modern approach with traditional values. Have a great day.